G'day guys and welcome back to Tomb Raider Legend of Lara Croft. I got it right this time. I had to think about it, but I got it right this time. Uh, previously on, we've united... Well, I say we. I say Charles Devereaux has united two of the stones. I believe one is power, the other one is wrath. Created a big explosion in the hotel room where Croft and Zip were staying in. A boy Jonah's still alive, but he's being mind-controlled by Charles Devereaux. Uh, we learned about the light and Trinity. And that about sums up last episode. Um, well, we started the episode with the fishing village being destroyed by the tidal wave. And that's what led to everything happening this that episode. So we know we're going to pick up right from the explosion, but before we get to this episode, just want to remind everyone that my Patreon is now live with full length reactions to this show and every show I'm doing and every show I'll be doing in the future. Um, you will need to sync up your own footage as there is no reference footage in those reactions, so you can watch along, whether it's for the first time or you want to rewatch the show or the episode, and we can just, you can watch along, we can have some fun. That's about it for now, at least. But in the meantime, let's just get to episode four. <sighs> what happened? Uh... Damn. That's a lot of damage. That's no good. Purple lightning too. Aiden was right. It won't be unicorns. Devro wants the stones to take out the light, the secret society that killed his father. Maybe by learning more about them, I can figure out where he's going next. There's only one problem. I'm going to have to go to the worst place in the world. Paris? Why is that the worst place in the world? to the home of an Interpol agent is a serious crime, right? Okay. I ain't bailing you out. I was wondering what she was There's up to. No other way. Cam would never tell me what I need to know if I asked. Cam. Cam who? Wait, 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 wait. Do you know this woman? Who's Cam? Camilla Roth. Ah. We grew up together. Maybe if I learn what happened, I'll know how to stop him. Stop who? She got moves. Lara Croft. She wanted a hug. Then let me guess. You're here to steal something. Then you have one minute before I call the police. You dating anyone? <laughs> no. Job? Delivered furniture for a bit. Was a bouncer for a while. <laughs> That'd be fun to see. Mm -hmm. What happened between those two? <laughs> you little rascals! <laughs> the Light is a secret society started here in Paris. Descendants of the Knights Templar. The Templars? Well, so they That's what I said last episode. It really sounds like the Templars. <laughs> Big group being hunted down like dogs, being destroyed because people feared their power and stuff. You think the Light killed him? Why? Lara? Don't tell me she's vanished already. Wow. Oh. Okay. New record. Two minutes, thirty five seconds. To you. You're just like my father. Thank you. It was not a compliment. Mm. We need more backstory. You used to see a hill and think of it as a challenge from nature. That was you, but I learned it from you. <laughs> Hills are a challenge from nature. I hate them. Maybe we can have a little adventure. The smallest. Right, Lara and Cam back together again. Jacques de Molay. Leader of the Templars in the 14th century. Mm. The Knights Templar were created to protect Christians traveling through the Holy Land. 
but when they returned from the Crusades, something went wrong. Greed, maybe. The legend is they began to worship a disembodied head called Baphomet. That was both funny and terrifying. Yeah. <laughs> Lara, this place is so clearly terrible. It's, it's a front. front. Mm. Medieval churches were often built over catacombs. Well, of course, it's intentionally blacked out. We're too far underground. What do you think the connection is? Knights Templar and the light. The I'm light sure, were the but Templar. They killed a man deliberately to gain access to these catacombs. There's something here they needed. Maybe it's betrayal, not greed. Bats and rats, huh? Something scared them. That's not normal behavior. Not at all. It moved. This is not a nice place to be in. It's creepy as hell. Baphomet. Hello there. Baphomet. The stories are true. The gold of Peril Stone. It was here. The Stone of the Betrayal. Stone of okay. Betrayal. That makes more sense than greed. From God. The Templars who survived did become the light. Mm. If you were hunted down like a dog, what would you want? Revenge. Revenge. Camilla? Freaky as hell. Nothing. Of course not, milady. She hates you. You stole her father from her. <laughs> That's what she thinks, anyway. What the hell? Is that Baphomet? Or just a gargoyle or something? Golem. Now what? Uh... It's better to go to my. You keep at this pace. You just might, little bird. Yeah. Freaky. What a mind fuck. Uh, help! Please, Uncle Ward! You fell because you thought someone would save you. The sooner you stop needing people, the sooner you learn to survive. <laughs> people? They're just burdens. That's not something you teach a child. Trippy. Lara, do you trust me? Of course. You're my best friend. Yes. Yes, I am. And I won't let anything bad happen to you. Come on, Lara. Now, she's focused. There were actual people? What? Skeletons? They're cultists. Okay. They weren't skeletons. Just actual people. 
I was able to find the vents and close them. Oh, good work, Camilla. The assassinations. <sighs> Targets. They're all here. It's a murder board. <laughs> the people who could challenge them. The light approached Devro Senior to buy the church. He refused. So they killed him the and took it. To stay a safe place for the homeless. They killed him and took it anyway. Yeah. All for a stone that's not even here. The Salgadi is a heavily guarded heritage site. He would have needed the power of the other stones first to even get close. The gold yeah. stone is next. He can control How people's minds. Because it's what I would do. Hmm. Damn. I guess we're off to Iran next, huh? My life, the traveling, the tents. You said you'd rather be home with your mom in Paris. Putain de merde. I never said that. It's so just what he thinks? Because you thought I was replacing you. Replacing? Lara, you were like a sister to me. Hmm. I figured it was what, like, that's what she thought. <laughs> cool handshake. There's our heading. Poor oh. Jonah. All right, so I mean, we basically learned what we knew all along, anyway, was that the Templars were the light. Um, uh, and Devereaux was literally just going after them for revenge because they killed his father because they wanted the church for a, a stone that wasn't even there in the first place. Um, uh, we met Camilla. He's an Interpol agent, head of the crime division. Um, uh, that's about it, really. We just got a, a bit of a backstory on the Templar and what they got up to. With uh, Baphomet. Um, and that's about it. <laughs> really. A uh, very quick 20 minutes. I'm fascinated by this show. We're, all, we're, in, we're already halfway through. That was episode four. We've only got four episodes left, man. Um, everything's happening really quick. Yeah, let me know what you'll think about this series so far. As, we're hit, as we've just hit that halfway point. Let me know what you'll think in the comment section down below. What has been your favorite episode so far? How do you think this series is going to end if you've already binged watch it? No spoilers, please. Let me know what you'll think in the comment section down below. But in the meantime, if you'll enjoy this reaction and want to see more, be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and of course, join me next time for more Tomb Raider Legend of Lara Croft. Bye, guys.